Uh, yeah. Um, what we've come to talk about is what not to do when a guard dog's working around college. So, for example, if you see us walking with the handles and everything, just leave us. Don't distract the dogs. Just let us do our job yeah. and get to the canteen or wherever we're going. And don't make any distracting noises like cat noises or try to call the dog over when the dog's working. For example, like going... Say that like, like when you're coming from the canteen, Yeah. going back down to class, they'll start trying to call the dog over. It's like, come here, uh, like, come on then, this way, this so, way, sort of thing. And we don't need that, we just need everyone just to carry on as if the dogs aren't there. Yeah. As if we're using canes, not our dogs. Exactly, because then the dogs know that they're not being mm. distracted, they're doing a good job, so... And we're not bumping into things, yeah. trying to sort the dogs out, trying to get their concentration yeah. back. Also, it would be advisable as well when we're coming into the building for people to give us a bit of room to get in with the dog because they're just standing about so the dog has to do more work and go too far over to get round the person. So for example if you see us walking down the ramps just move off the ramp totally Yeah. and let us have the whole ramp for the dog's sake. And then, then there's no aggravation being caused. And please don't leave litter on the floor for the dogs to pick up. Yeah, because if they pick, if they pick up any of the litter and swallow it, it ends up making us clean up after them if they have an accident. 